Hello, and welcome back to the Episode 6 A Portal's Mystery. A Portal Mystery. Portal. Portal 2. Portal 3 is Previously on Minecraft oh, okay. Story Mode. It's still pretty loud. That glow. That and I'm using a, the work of a, very a mouse, not a controller anymore, because my controller broke. I'm a cry. The order of the stone. Oh yeah, they went to the sky world. Oh yeah, they found all the portals. So which one did they choose? Are they all different? That's what I want to know. Which one did they go in? Oh my goodness, there's bat- It's Batman! They're in a graveyard! They fell. Nerds. Still swagging out my purple okay, armor. Guys, I'm seeing grass, forest, lots of ground in all directions. All good signs so far. <clears throat> what happened? Oh, uh, all this tumens. Uh. Verdict says, definitely not our world. You owe me two iron, Lucas. <laughs> hey up. Okay, okay. Here. <laughs> I uh. told you it was a dumb bet. Oh, who asked you? Oh, Whoa. come on, can't you hear it? A uh, spooky forest? It's the sound of a new adventure. I bet this place is going to be awesome. Yay. Oh, right. I was just... Uh, I'm just worried about Axel and Olivia. Oh, yeah. What? Why? Well, if they followed us back to that old builder temple and went through the portal, they would arrive in Sky City to find it overflowing with monsters. Yeah. At least we already built them the bridge. That is more than we started with. Uh, they shouldn't have followed us. Followed us. They had a lot going on in town. We'll get home and they'll be super jealous they missed out on all this. Well, well, I for one vote that we not be so hasty to try and get out of here. Who knows what sorts of treasures this new world could hold. Besides, unless the next portal is disguised as a tombstone, I'm not seeing it anywhere near here. You guys Ooh, see a book. some sort of shape over there? Yeah. What is that? It's a Bible. Let's find out. Uh, oh. Oh, okay. I'm walking. I'm walking. I'm talking. Can I walk any faster? No. Okay. Oh, it's a written book. Not just any book. Can I grab it? It says invitation. And then read immediately. Your life depends on it. Oh, no. <laughs> Greetings, traveler. Yep, that seems about right. No, I guess they were. Oh, it makes sense. We're in a graveyard. Got your back. I humbly invite you to my mansion for an evening of food and festivity with your fellow adventurers. That's I kicked him. Odd. Yeah, weird, right? Whoa! Get kicked. Oh, oh, get bitched up with the book. Wait, what's the point of tossing it? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh. I wasn't ready. I'm not ready. I'm not used to these controllers. Or can people now? You can read, right? Hang on, hang on. Need to find Jesse's place. Uh, got it. Ugh. Come to my home on the hill. Just follow the path. Please look out for zombies. Sincerely, the host. Nice warning. Come on, there's the path. Yay. So, what's the point of going through here I again? Must say, this is the highest concentration of zombies I've ever seen in one place. Oh, no shit, it's a graveyard. You think this host is gonna be legit, Jesse? Probably not. I just asked because this place hasn't exactly been friendly so far. Boy, well, I hope so. I wouldn't mind getting out of the zombies for a bit. Yeah, we're all good today. Oh, Terror Wayne's Mansion. And say, that's the place we're looking for. Race you guys there. Oh yeah, I don't race so much anymore. Bad, bad knees. Oh. Hope that fighting helped you work up an appetite, Petra, because you're about to eat my dust. 
Oh, big words, Jesse. Yep. Why did you stop? You should have ran when I said that. Whatever hype through episode 6, because why not? How to buy it. Even though I bought the game. So, whatever, just take my money. Oh, wait, why is it not saving? It didn't save. On cloud thingy. Velocity to dodge objects. How do I dodge? It wasn't dodging. Oh, I push it. How do I hold it? I'm confused. Dumbass. Oh, that stone brick just glitched out for some reason. Let's see, it's glitching out. Yo, get, get, get assassinated. Oh, yo. How far is this thing? Wait, where did the... Um Petra and Lucas go. Just the river. Oh, get pushed in. Well, I found him. Can I swing? Bitch, get out the way. Boo, bitch. Wee. Oh, there's a spooter. Spooter, man. You hear that too, right? No. Almost sounds like a oh, really? a waterfall. I know the words. Uh. Owie. Oh, so it's impossible to make it up there. I feel more control now with the keyboard and mouse, but whatever. Oh my goodness, there's still bench. Oh, I thought they're just dying in there. Oh, I know. I was say, nerds, get fucked. Alright, moving again. Look, he keeps trying to save and then, like, it breaks. It says no. Whatever. We just have to deal with it. Oh, I paused it. Oh, it's basis pause? Why? Seems very pointless. Yeah. Boom. Totally could happen. Fuck is that? Yeah. Don't, 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 don't. Alright, I think it's this episode or the next episode, but I know that there's YouTubers in here. Okay. You won that one, Jesse. Let's maybe get inside the mansion before we pat ourselves on the back too much, shall we? Well, I like how he's mean, and then like he's like all sincere. That front door's definitely a no-go. Why not? <gasps> Stick with me, guys. Look, see, he's trying to save every single time. I'm gonna fix that after we get inside. Whenever the game wants to hurry up and get inside. Oh, I pushed the fucking Q. Damn it. Oh, I pushed E this time. Whoa. What was that? 
blood. What'd you see? So you Jacko just man. Gasped. L like you'd seen something. Run oh shit. Okay, okay, tell us when we get inside then. Oops. Oops. Oopsies. Great! There's no door back here. Oh no, there's supposed to get in. The trees. There, the window. we should be able to build up and break in through there. Trees, we can cut those down. Oh, I was thinking about parkour. Oh, man. My inventory is full of wood blocks. Hey, you never know when those will come in handy. Oh, yes. Looks like some kind of kitchen in there. Then break the window and get us into the blasted place. Punch. Hope the host doesn't mind us breaking their window. I'm sure he'll find it in his heart to forgive us. Why didn't they turn it into uh, planks? Wow. Invitation Some of kids. fire death. Hot dog. You know I don't care if you took it. Just give it back. And I'm telling you for the last no, I'm too scared. Time, sparkles, I didn't take the stupid thing. I think we can avoid a lot of unpleasant. Oh no, Captain uh, Sparkles. Hi. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Very, very funny. Show up super late, make us all sit and wonder what the heck is going on. Now, this is your house, right? Because if it is, we've all been waiting for like hours. It's rude. Now, easy, Torque Dog. We got one of these invitations, too. What the heck is going on here? Dog. Dark. Sorry for the language. That wasn't about you getting an invitation. Just that I was hoping you could explain things. This is Torque Dog. Sup? And I'm Captain Sparkles. Though, maybe you know that already. Captain Sparkles? I've got, like, nine million fans? Captain Sparkles? <laughs> Are you saying that with a Z? Petra! Show some respect! The man's a captain. He's a it really is awesome to meet you. I'm Jesse, and that's Petra, Lucas, and Ivor. Charmed. <laughs> Jesse? That's a girl's name. What are you guys anyway? Some sort of <laughs> loser patrol? Talk dog. Oh, come on. That was hilarious. Uh, Actually, we're the go? Order of the Stone. Ooh, legendary ooh, bang. heroes. Kind of a big deal. Legendary heroes? <laughs> I ain't never heard of you. Oh, fuck you then. Talk dog. Cool it. That sea of zombies has us all trapped. So we just need to try our best to get along. Worst day ever just try and look on the bright side wait how many more people are in this place counting us seven mm-hmm most of them useless i tell you what the minute all them weird zombies are gone <coughs> torque dog is out of here okay so the sea of zombies isn't normal it's good to hear two moons is normal though right um the moons uh, yeah why don't you know about this stuff you from like out of town or something? E. Now. Did you hear that? Holy oh, shit. I think, my butt. My butt. I think it stopped. What's up with the lights? Everyone die for cover. <gasps> Damn, he got fucked in the butt. Hey, Jesse. Jesse, come here. He's gonna diss me. I'm calling it. You've got a, a girl's name. <sighs> Free shit. Uh, Torque dog? Torque dog? So I'm guessing calling dibs on his inventory would be Ivor. Jesse isn't just a girl's name. All those arrows, <laughs> his inventory, everywhere. How did that. Who. One minute he's alive, the next, gone, poof. Wow, you seem pretty broken up about this. Were you guys close? I mean, it's like the terrible uh, question. Really? He was kind of a tough guy to be close with, but it's still terrible. I guess. Everyone stand back. Let me see what I can figure out. Okay. This is, why is this happening? Gunpowder, um. redstone dust, leather pants. Pretty much what you'd expect, I guess. Uh, 
Who would do this? There's the trapdoor that sucked up Torque Dog's stuff. Looks like it's a match set with that arrow dispenser up there. But you saw his stuff. He didn't really have anything worth stealing. Perhaps it was simply to dispose of the evidence. Makes sense. Guys, found something strange about this arrow. Yeah, Ivor, you know potions and enchantments and weird stuff like that. What do you make of it? The fuck? Mm. Smells like... Yes. Potion of poison? Oh, is it a tipped arrow? Oh, I've heard Just of those. They're, they're Just still pretty new. Oh, nasty stuff. Using potions to make arrows. The possibilities are fascinating. Would you stop pointing that thing all over the place? You're making me nervous. You say you know about these tipped arrows? Tip. Anything Just the else tip. you know that you're not telling us? Well, you're, you're not implying what I think you're implying, are you? Because I had nothing to do with this. Nothing. Could have sworn I saw someone doing a tutorial on how to make those not too long ago. My nerves are too shot to remember who right now. Well, let me know if it comes back to you. Look how we're giving him shit. Everything okay in here? Whoa! What's with the crowd? I, uh, I was just about to get everyone together to tell them at once. Okay? Hang on a minute. It's you! I recognize you! Yay! Excuse me? Uh, yes. What? Recognize us? How? I'll show you. Follow me. Um, okay. Okay. Who's that? Lizzie, hi. Did you see all these new... Oh, you've got them with you. <gasps> dun, 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 dun. Well, first it was the portraits of the people already here, then poof, you guys. Whoa, that's unexpected. Yeah, no kidding. They're absolutely exquisite. Perfect. <laughs> well, not perfect. Absolutely perfect. They fucked up on his nose. That's funny. It must have been when we showed up. Flattering how well they captured our likenesses. I just can't figure it out. Who would have done this? We've kind of been asking ourselves the same question. Well, that's definitely not a good sign. Come on, everyone. Let's huddle up in the dining room. Wonder if he told them yet. Can't wait to hear the big news. Me neither. Ooh, I hope there's cake. Guess not. Come on, let's do this. Come on, Winslow. She gets a cat. Where's my pet? Where's... Oh. Ruben died. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. Here, let me introduce you all properly. You guys already met Cassie Rose and LD Shadow Lady. Uh, but my friends call me Lizzie. This is Stacy Plays, Stampy Cat, and that's Dan, the Diamond Minecart. W when did your hair change color? Wasn't it? It's funny. Before you guys showed up, we all knew each other here. They're the Order of the Stone. Jesse, Petra, Lucas, and Ivor. Apparently, they're famous heroes where they come from. You said there was news? Is it good? Good news? Uh, if you count that yeah, guy being dead. It's, um, bad news, I'm afraid. Torque Dog is dead. Good heavens! Oh, no. Wait, what? But Torque Dog was so tough! There was nothing that could take him down. What happened? Yeah, what on earth is going on here, Sparkles? Show him to arrow. These are what got him. Tipped arrows? Does this mean someone set a trap for Torque Dog? That's nasty. Nasty. I can't believe Talk Dog's gone. Just like that. Alright, who's gonna die so next? What happened to his stuff? Whoa! How can you say that? What? It's a valid question. Whoa. Come on, everyone. Come on. Don't get greedy. Just I wanna know what happened. For curiosity's sake. I mean I would have said the same thing. Disappeared. Went down this weird hole in the floor. Are we just supposed to take your word for that? Guys, I saw it too. 
Jesse was poking around in Torque Dog's stuff right before it got sucked into a hopper. So I'm looking at this situation, I'm trying to figure something out. Is this just about Torque Dog, or is there a bigger picture? Yeah, why have our portraits? I don't know, guys. Knowing Torque Dog, I think this might just be about him. Am I picking up some beef here? Uh, what? No! I don't know what you're talking about. What, oh, like damn. you think he deserved it? Oh, damn. Well, that sounds pretty harsh, but, uh, I don't know, maybe? I probably well, would the same, same thing. Here for a reason, including Talk Dog. What if we're all in danger? Oh my gosh, Dan's right. Whoever's doing this, they could be hunting us. Hey, come on, everyone. If there's one thing I believe in, it's teamwork. If we all teamwork. Team will be fine. You gotta be teamwork. Inspiring. There you go, guys. Teamwork makes the dream work. Wow. Shrek. Oh, all of this danger talk has my stomach all queasy. Stampy, come over here. I need to talk to you about something. Lizzie. Oh, damn. Psst. Lizzie. The more I think about it, the more I think that there's something these people really don't want us to know. One of them's got to know the truth about what's going on here. It'd be nice to figure out what on earth is going on here, especially if we're going to be stuck with these people until dawn. Sounds like we've got a mystery to solve, people. Luckily, uh. Detective Jesse is on the case. Let's get investigating then. Dun, dun, dun. Wait, what is this? What is that crowd looking thing? Hey there, Dan. Lizzie? Oh, uh, hello? Hi there. If you don't mind, I actually had some questions about this torque dog situation. Yeah? Go ahead. Uh, why? Why? Lizzie, seems like you're not much of a torque dog fan. What's the deal? Oh, come on. You met him, right? Nobody liked that guy. <laughs> He's just the only one who will actually admit it. Damn. He, um, yeah, he definitely wasn't the nicest person. Seem like people were really interested in seeing Torque Dog's inventory. Any idea why? An adventurer like him? He could have had all kinds of cool stuff. Uh huh. Torque Dog was clearly targeted with this trap. Why him? Well, he was bragging about having some kind of rare item. Wouldn't show it to anyone, of course. Typical Torque Dog. So, this rare item that Torque Dog claimed to have. Mm. What well, can you tell me about it? We don't know exactly. Yeah, sorry. Okay. Okay, that's it for now. Thanks. What'd you find out? It's all tangled up, but it sounds like Torque Dog claimed to have some sort of rare item. Yay. I didn't see anything like that in his inventory, though. Yeah, something's not quite adding up here. Why is there a picture of a zombie riding chicken? I'll leave the captain to last. Because he's like the only one I know. But whatever. Hey guys! Stampy and Stacy, right? Oh, um, uh, hello! Hey, Jesse. What's up? I know things are a little nuts right now, but I've got some questions. Oh, really? Uh, but well, what? Stacy, you seem pretty curious about what was in Torque Dog's inventory. What's up with that? Well, Torque Dog was a pretty notorious thief. I was just curious what he had. That's it. Mm-hmm. Damn. Seems like Lizzie and Torque Dog really didn't like each other. Know anything else about that? Oh, that. Real shame. Real shame. He broke into her house and stole a bunch of stuff from her. She was super upset about it. Damn. Don't say. What a thief. Anyone you can think of that would want something bad to happen to Torque Dog? Um, well, I never had that big of a problem with him personally, but I know other people did. Quite a few, actually. I don't know if you noticed, but he was a bit of a griefer. Yeah, and a thief. Thief, huh? Interesting. Thanks, you two. This has been enlightening. So am I supposed to act on no, that last probably. question every time? Yeah. No problem. Or what's happening here? So, did you find anything out from Stacy or Sturdy Cat? Stampy Cat? Right, right. So, did you find anything out? 
Apparently, Torque Dog was a well-known thief. A thief, huh? Well, that might have something to do with it, don't you think? Agreed. All right, last but not least, talk to. Hey, Sparkles and Cassie Rose, yeah? Yep. Hi, that's me. Hey there, Jesse. Oh, Winslow says hi too. <laughs> you mind if I ask you guys some questions? <laughs> like, okay. Nope. What are the questions? Uh, let's ask the last there question. There was drama between Lizzie and Torque Dog, right? Got any insight? Sorry, I'm not getting wrapped up in that. Especially now that Torque Dog is, you know. But it's weird, right? Definitely seems like there's some beef. Uh, not that I um, want to get into rumors or anything like that. Um. Uh... Cassie, you seem pretty upset about people wanting to poke around Torque Dog's inventory. Oh, was I? Yeah, yeah, you were. Why was that? Well, it was just so... It's insensitive, right? I mean, it, it had just happened, and she was all curious about what was in his pockets. Just made me mad, I guess. Team. I asked Stacy about why she wanted to see Torque Dog's inventory so bad. She said she was just curious. Huh, just like me. What a coincidence. Team. Got any guesses why someone would kill Torque Dog? Why was it the first one? Oh, gosh, gosh, um... He was a little prickly around the edges, you know? You'd have to ask other people dick. about that. I, I didn't really know him. Mm-hmm. I don't want to say anything mean about a guy that's not here to defend himself, but, well, you met him, right? Prickly is kind of an understatement. Damn. Sparkles, Cassie, Winslow, thanks for the time. No problem. Uh, yeah, anytime. Get anything out of them? There's a whole lot of secrets they're keeping from each other. That's definitely something. So, Torque Dog was a thief, and he supposedly had something rare, but I feel like there's still a piece missing. No one will tell me what this rare item is. I, uh, I think I can shed some light on that situation, actually. Well, now my curiosity has peaked. He already had me at rare item. Oh, for, oh, just tell me what this thing is already. Okay, okay, I'm going to, I'm going to. There's a temple way out in the middle of nowhere. No one knows who built it, but it's been there forever. It, is it a People desert temple? People trying to track down the temple's location for ages because they want this treasure. It's supposedly deep in its basement. Now, it looks just like an ordinary <coughs> flint and steel, but it's actually super rare. It's got this enchantment on it. It can open portals to other worlds? Exactly. Wait, what? You know about the enchanted flint and steel? How did you know that? Did, have, you, have you seen it? Have you seen it today? Yeah. I actually have one of my own. Really? Yeah, yeah I do. Just used it a little no, while ago to get... Put that away. You, you can't just pull that out here. Okay. Uh, you know, I had a theory about why you were here... And I, I think this might just prove it. All right, so Sparkles is like the main everyone, character out of this cast. Everyone, we've all been freaking out, wondering why we were all brought here. Why uh, Torque Dog died? Uh, and Jesse has just uncovered a very important clue. What? Really? Whoever killed Torque Dog, whoever invited us, they're after the enchanted flint and steel. Ah! Sparkles? Damn. adventurers. Damn. 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 He died. Why is his hair brown? Hang on, hang on. This is awful. Terrible. Who was that guy? And there's no such thing as white dog kids. The white pumpkins hanging all over the place. I don't like it. I really don't. I actually saw him in the window when we first got here. You mean he's been in here the whole time? I'm so getting out of here. 
Fuck this shit, I'm out. No, she's gonna die next. Typical song. So much for a nice dinner party. Yep. I don't like the sound of that. Oh. You dumb cunt. Shut the door, shut the door! There's a lever right right there. And if we're stuck in here, we're all doomed. Lexi has brown hair now. What the fuck? I thought I heard That's Barbara very suspicious. I think it's him. Steal. Oh, please don't bring that up again. Well, obviously, Talk Dog didn't steal it. Okay, but who then? Uh, Jesse? Damn. Damn. No sprinkles. Well, I guess I'm next then. Nope, not happening. Don't worry, Ivor. I'll protect you. I appreciate that, Jesse. I just hope that this white pumpkin isn't beyond both of our abilities. Well, I'm sure there's a perfectly logical explanation for how the white pumpkin is doing all this. I mean, the whole place has got to be rigged with traps, right? Torque dog, trap. Sparkles, trap. Yeah, we need to find out what makes these traps tick. Damn. All right, I'm gonna investigate that dining room. Cool. I'll keep those guys in the hall for now so I can keep an eye on everyone. An excellent idea. Don't want them messing up the crime scene. I'm sticking with you, Jesse. Doesn't seem safe to wander off alone. Okay, people, clear out. This is a crime scene. Okay, how are you doing this, White Pumpkin? Hmm. 